We're live at Newson Stadium in Nashville, home of the Lycans, where country music started. A uh, bit of trivia for you, Grim. Nashville has the lowest number of teeth per person. Whatever. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Carolina Panthers battle the Nashville Lycans. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're gonna love seeing mutants knock cold, their brains turn into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. MFL game day is on the air. Ah, uh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm gonna go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And that's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth growing out of the roof of my mouth? What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something Unique About Yourself. That's unique. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Great run for a nine yard game. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. point but this guy could blow it it's good when you give up points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay First and ten. That's a six yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Third down and five. And the defense goes for the juggle. You know, if he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, Keska say, what the fuck, the fuck, the fuck? First and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. Third down and, well, good luck. 
looking for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boot dirty trick. Fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. And he misses that extra point. Oh, well, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. It's probably why he missed. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. That's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Hot two. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Hot one. Hot two, hot, 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 hot. Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. And that'll be a first down. You know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old-school mano a mano on the turf, huh? And it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one in the end zone. Nicely done! I can't run like that unless it's Cooper Knight and Taco Hell. He has better footwork though than me on a kind of not clenching his cheeks though. <laughs> Well, that should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine?
And it's first and ten. Coleman about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. Oh boy, they're going for it. This could get uglier than the baby resulting from an orcish family reunion. And that'll make the highlight reel for what not to do on fourth down. First and ten. Uh, something went very wrong with that box away. What was your first hit? The lack of blood, everyone having all their limbs? He's your enemy. Second down and ten. Oh, oh, oh. That gets me every time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. And it's first and ten. The defense called the one speed dirty trick. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. Second down and six. First down. And it's first and ten. When defensive players go berserk, they've been known to rip the head. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. The defense is relentless out there, and they get the turnover. Oh, that was a big hit. And Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is, ah, I forgot my point. Second down and long. <laughs> and 
No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Take the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Whoop, 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 whoop. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. And it's first and ten. The defense has the receivers covered well. That's a three-yard gain on that pass. Second down and seven. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! And they come to the line trying to tie this up with two points. And if they don't, things are going to get weird and desperate on this sideline. Hey, give them more credit, Bricks. They're not... No one was going to stop him. That's two points. right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. six yards the offense calls a timeout this is why you save your timeouts so you can use them in the two-minute warning now I get it makes sense Grim and that'll be second down and four oh this guy just loves punishing the defenders that's a first down the quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And it's first and ten. And like a monkey trying to fuck off for the first down. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh his head just exploded. Yeah. Let miss, let miss. He's just shit. They're back up here on first, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. And that's it. That's the last time out. It's score or die from here out. Second down and a lot. He runs it for three. Third down and, well, good luck. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer?
And they're taking the field for the second half, and we have got a tie score. Speaking of tie, Grim, me and Hot Wanda, we wanted to try something different, so we tied each other up the other night, and nothing happened because we were both tied up. I don't understand what the big deal is. <laughs> They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Pow! With the brain scrambler! And it's first and ten. was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. And with a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. And it's first and ten. before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. Oh, sure. Now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. they say what kind of money and it's first and ten. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Missed a beat for Braves. Ran with a ball and didn't fall down. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And it's first and ten. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. <laughs> Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. We should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run.
And it's first and ten. Oh, nice hit. And that'll bring up second and one. away from that tackle. And a hard run there, picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. for two points. and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And that is caught for a first down. First down and seven. up about six on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! They're going for two. Two point plays are high risk, high reward, and it just didn't pay off. And now they're both screwed and stupid. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's 
First and ten. Oh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. The teams have kept each other at bay for now, but there's still plenty of time to bribe refs and kill the other team's star players, so it's anyone's game, really, Bricks. And that'll bring up second and one. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. Third down and a pussy here. He is fighting for every yard. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. It's first and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And that'll be second down and four. Much like my wedding night, there was a big explosion. But then everyone left disappointed. Everyone? You had more than two people in the room? Yeah, the guy filming and the clown. Somebody's got to make the balloon animals. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. <laughs> Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. And he's running like a moose right now. Ouch! What is this? Ain't he's wrestling? And it's first and ten. was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Second down and ten. <laughs> and he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. <laughs> And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go! He's unstoppable! And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down! And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps outside and attacks the QB. And the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. And it's first and ten. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Third down and three. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown.
down. You know, the league used to flag this for excessive celebration. You know, refs really don't want to get too close to the rabbit running out monsters. And don't even get me started on the werewolf. <laughs> Either way, they're going for two. And it plows forward for the two-point conversion. And that's quite a creative and intuitive dance he's doing. Hey, Grim, what do you call a wolf who was intuitive? I don't know, what? And a werewolf. <laughs> oh, man, I just cracked myself up. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. <laughs> and it's first and ten. First and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. <laughs> Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I top off my drink. Grab me a scotch while you're up. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. point attempt. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. First and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that'll be second down and four. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Oh, uh, you're telling me. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about bad hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. We're deadlocked with a tie score at the end of the fourth, and that can mean only one thing. Stay tuned, because what the hell could be more important right now? Well, now that you mention it, Grim, I really need to hit the can.
Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. Starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. And it's first and ten. And he was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. And it's why he's a defense, schmuck. Second down and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. Third down and eight. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. The punter for today is being played by my kid's sister. Or at least it seems like it. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snags. He got hit by a car. Holy crap, he runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Ball man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. with the brain scrambler. Second down in a very lot. And there's a huge gain and this offense is rolling. Margaret, that was a pass play. Rolling plays him in bowling. Third down in a sliver. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down of seven. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second and three.
suffer a howling defeat today with this home loss. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. God, that was beautiful. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhawk Corporation. They get it right every other.